Today we will talk about sinus arrhythmia. You will see this usually in the setting of normal sinus rhythm or sinus bradycardia. So sinus arrhythmia means that there's a variation between the P2P interval of more than 10%. If you have a look at uh, this strip, you can see that this P2P is much longer than this P2P and is different than this P2P. Before you make this diagnosis, you have to make sure that there are no dropped P waves. What I mean is that there are no P waves that don't have a QRS with them. So if you check over here, you don't have a dropped P wave, you don't have a dropped P wave, you don't have a dropped P wave. All what is happening is that the P to P interval is changing. We see this usually when the patient has um, a low heart rate and this finding is very benign. And the way to read it is that you're gonna say that this patient has sinus bradycardia with sinus arrhythmia. And the sinus arrhythmia happens either due to um, the nervous conduction of the heart changing with respiration or due to other things. Most likely, it's respiration.